Chinatown seemed to have peaked out after the urban renewal came through and kind of uh, tore down some of the buildings. And uh, back then, uh, Pacific Renaissance Plaza was not existent. They were all empty lots. And they had bulldozed the whole section of Oakland, these uh, dilapidated old buildings. So finally, uh, a bunch of us businessmen got together and said, what can we do to draw the people in? Okay, and because my wife and I, when we were young, we didn't have money, we went to a lot of street fairs and said, hey, there's a lot of people come to these things. We ought to do something like that. So we did it and surprisingly, uh, it just grew and grew to the point uh, that I can confidently say it's the largest Asian street fest in all of North America. We don't know, even South America, we don't know anybody that has 100,000 people over a two-day period. And it's maybe about 10 years ago, San Francisco came over and interviewed us and wanted us to help them start their street fest, and they did. So theirs is pattern after ours, but they have more difficulties because of the narrow street and the side streets. And if you ever go to theirs, you're going to see how disjoint they are in comparison to what we do here.